Now, about eight counters are down today. Uh, foreigners seem to be taking a low profile. Uh, briefly, let us in on who's taking the markets down and why. Um, this is the second week of February, and obviously the market is very slow at this time, uh, where we have uh, most of the investors waiting to see uh, in the next couple of days the kind of announcements that are come, going to come through. So most people are taking positions where people have made some money, they're trying to get out um, so that we're able to pack money for the next round of announcements. So we are going to see most people trying to get off and, and stay outside. Talking of a round of announcements, EABL results come out tomorrow. The share price today uh, dropped two shillings. And there has been talk of flat earnings. If we look at what Diageo um, announced last week, their East African arm is volumes were down 11%, but net, net sales were up about 4%. Uh, does this say anything of what we are likely to see tomorrow? Now, it does say a lot, actually. If you look at the first uh, the half year, uh, you saw that uh, the, the, the turnovers were pretty much flat. And in fact, the turnovers are much more less in Kenya. They are driven so much by the sales across the region, uh, Uganda, Southern Sudan, Tanzania. So um, I think the second half may not have been very, very much different. So because of that, I think we should be able to see the results much more plain. Probably uh, as of the 31st of December, uh, there was no much activity. So don't expect much to happen other than what you saw. Uh, still on results, uh, we expect Barclays to report, I think, before the end of this week. It could be Thursday. Uh, but there's been also quite some laid-back activity. The stock is just up 25 cents uh, from previous trading. Uh, traders also say they expect very little organic growth on that particular counter. Do you share the same um, Yeah, yeah it, it is actually. If you look at the half year, June, the, 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 the turnovers, in fact, uh, on the profitability, they were just flat at about 4%. And in fact, that was an improvement because other banks were doing 1%, like KCB, uh, IQ was doing about 11%. So really, you don't expect much of a change because if you look at the second half of the year, last year, uh, interest rates were very, very much more down. Uh, TBs kept coming down. That's on one side. On the other side, the lending book did not grow. In fact, uh, much of the turnovers on the loan book remained flat. And all the loans that were maturing, they were never redeemed. They kept being accumulated back to assets. So you are going to see in the announcements coming forth, probably assets are up, uh, but uh, turnovers flat and profitability also very, very flat. We have to 